when you are uh, talk when we are talking about personalized uh, treatment, certainly in uh, in these uh, cases uh, when we we uh, we eat the imp- information about genetic predilection to uh, one or another disease, uh, including intracerebral hemorrhage, is of uh, of importance uh, without doubt. Uh, when we know that uh, uh, this concrete person has a high risk of development of intracerebral hemorrhage by having uh, one or another uh, gene uh, which uh, contributes to this uh, to this serious disease, we can uh, certainly at this moment we cannot uh, change uh, the genetic profile of this uh, of this particular person, but we can uh, certainly modify all other modifiable risk factors which may in turn increase the risk of intracerebral hemorrhage so by means of uh, of uh, uh, working or by means of modifying other risk factors than genetic ones we can in fact decrease the risk of development of intracerebral hemorrhage